Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Sergeant Buckshot, bringing you a little different video today. Uh, kind of running out of storage on my Xbox One. I've got nine games installed, and I'm under the settings here on the dashboard. We'll go under System, and we'll go over to Manage Storage. And as you see here, I'm 91.8% um, full. So today I went out and picked up a backup drive, USB 3.0, 2 terabyte drive. As you see, I've done opened it. Uh, let's see, we're going to go ahead and open this up. As you see here, you have your USB 3.0 with your power. Uh, it's just a little Seagate drive, 2 terabyte, nothing special. Also, it comes with, um, comes with a power brick. I prefer uh, hard drives with power bricks instead of powering it straight over USB. And as you see here, USB 3.0 cable. Um, the requirements for USB 3.0, you have to have a 3.0 drive, and you have to have a 256 gig or more storage device to store games on. Uh, that's what Microsoft requires. But um, we'll go ahead and jump into hooking it up. Okay, as you see here, I've got my USB 3.0. Spun my Xbox One around and I'm plugging it up to the bottom USB port. Right? If I can get it in there. There we go. Alright, there's a better look at it. Bottom USB port. Okay, now back to the front of the Xbox One. I have my USB cable hanging. Here's my power brick. And we're going to try to get some power down here. Um, got a mess of cables here. Let me dig through. There's me a plug. I'm going to have to lay the phone down for just a second so I can use both my hands. By the way, I'm recording this on my Samsung Galaxy S5. There we go. Got it plugged up. And right here's my cable. Run it up top. Lay it down. There you have it. There's both cables. There's my power cable and there's my USB 3.0. Okay, once you get to that point, uh, you can pull out your hard drive and your USB 3.0 and your power brick. And we're going to plug them up right here. I'll have to look away for a minute, sorry. I'll show you as soon as they get them plugged up. There we go, light on, uh, power, USB 3.0. And we'll fix the cables. Here we go. Sits nicely right beside the Xbox One, as you can see. And I twist the camera the wrong direction. All right. Okay, now uh, we're back. I've got everything hooked up. Got my uh, my two terabyte hard drive. I don't know where my box is. Let me grab the box. Got my two terabyte hard drive hooked up. Uh, USB 3.0. And now we're going to check and see if we need to format this drive. Since everything's hooked up, uh, power, USB, that's all we need. So we'll jump right back into the settings once I turn my controller on. Alright, controller. There we go. Alright, here we go into the settings. I want to go over to system once again. And manage storage. And as you see, right here is a external 1.8 terabyte pictures, music videos, all that good stuff. So we want to go down to format for games and apps. Alright, set up external drive. We're going to format storage device and give it a name. We're going to give it a name. We're just going to name it Buckshot. Keep it simple. S-H-O-T. There we go. Buckshot and install things by default. Yeah, we want to do that by default so we can free up some of this uh, internal storage. So, install new things here. Format Buckshot. Format. Alright, here we go. And select a storage device. Do I want to do that? I guess it's actually formatting now. Maybe. I hope. We'll give it a little bit of time. Hopefully it'll show back up. 
as you notice, um, my internal hard drive is pretty full. So um, we're going to pause the video and I'll be right back unless, actually, there's my percentage. It shows, it's showing up. I ain't going to pause the video. Alright everyone, we have our um, hard drive up and running. As you see, 0% usage. So I have a uh, 2 terabyte hard drive on my Xbox One now, plus my 500. So um, now I can install games. Um, so I can, I'll have 20, 30 games on this drive. So I hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks.